0344 499 1000. It only costs you pennies to call up, maybe free. We call you back. Simple as. Keith's on the line. Good evening, Keith. Hello, Ian. Hello, Keith. Hi. Hello. Hi, I was I was phoning about uh, you. You were on about the rabbit hole thing. Yes. Um. Did you? Are you looking for contributions from the public, like, or is it just what you're going to be doing? Well, I I am. Um, I want this to. Uh, so I want to create a channel, right? A, a channel where right. people can go and get all my bits and pieces. But I, I, it did cross my mind that maybe. If there were, you know, listeners that had made something that was interesting and was good, then it might be an idea to put that on the channel as well. What What have you made, Keith? Oh, it's not. It, it's nothing much like. But me, me nephew, Ari, he's um, very fast runner, and I take videos of it. It's really, it's interesting to see his progress. Yes, but. yes. Fast runner, you say? How How fast is Harry? Oh well, he's twenty. He's fifteen, right? Yes. And he's done the two hundred meters in thirty-four seconds. It's a good quality run. That the two hundred meters in thirty-four seconds. Aye. I think I could do it faster. I used to run the four hundred meters in yeah. forty-eight seconds. Oh no! Um, well, it's it's in his year group. It's he's you know third or fourth best. Does he know that you make these videos? Oh, yeah. No, it's sports. It's what you call sports video, you know. It's good, but it's not. Sports videos. No, uh, we, we sport video. Sports so videos. We put, we put, you know, inspirational music on it, like... Um, huh? Chariots yeah, of Fire? Co- co- no, more dead, like Coldplay. Or, Snow uh, Patrol. Or my, wife likes, my wife likes to put you two on. Okay, yes. Yeah. Yeah. And... um. So the image, so it's him running. But do you choose songs that are thirty-eight seconds long? Nah, they just run out when they run out. You know. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I know. And do you? I'm not saying you'd yeah, be to be great, but people might have videos that are more fun than just the running. You know. Right. So I just wondered if you'd be interested in them. I wasn't quite clear on that. No, I know. Do you put titles on? Like words? Um, well, sport, sport video presents, and it'll be, for this one, be fast running. Hang on a minute. Sport, so, it's sport video. <laughs> sport video. So you've made, like, you've got a little production company. Oh, no, it's, no, it's just for when the cousins come round and the family's round. And that. Sport video so, presents. So. Well, and what was that movie called? It's got fast running. Fast running. I would... Um, and what other um, titles do you have in the range? That's the only one we've done, really. But I, I'm saying it's not brilliant video or anything, but, you know, that, I just wondered if it was the sort of thing that maybe you'd like to put in the rabbit hole. And what... Um, yes, is the short answer, uh, Keith, is yes. It sounds exactly the sort of high quality um, product that we'd like to put on the rabbit hole. All oh, right. Yeah. Um, how much would you um, be prepared to pay to put what I send it to you when you pay? You pay like? No, no, no. You send it to me. And to be linked with such a prestigious award-winning broadcaster as myself, um, sport. What's it called? Sports films. No, sport. Sport video, but the particular one with me and nephew in is called Fast Running. Yeah, no, that's the title of the film, but the company is called Sport Films. Uh, it's not not a company. Ian is, but well, it's, you, I do it myself. Just yeah. with very little backup. Yeah. Um, and what do you film them on? What what kit are you using? It's just on my phone. Yeah. Um, I could put that up there for 50 quid. I will that be, what, four, four weeks of his pocket money, like? Oh, he's paying, is he? Well, I'm not paying for it. it. You know, I put a lot of work into the video itself. 
well, that is the thing. It could generate a big audience. Can I ask a question? When you're when you're filming it, are you? Do you hold the camera? It's a rectangular shape. The camera, yeah. Yeah. Do you hold it so the rectangle is pointing up? No, or? I don't do that. I put it. Um, I think they call it landscape. Yes, you do it landscape. Yeah. All right. If you don't, it's just like a strip in the middle of the telly. I I did that first off. Yeah. It was a shame because he was particularly fast that time. Like, And you missed most of it. No, I got it, but it's just in a little strip. I wouldn't be interested in that one. No. But the ones where you filmed in Lasker... I, I didn't put music that one in. I didn't even bother. How often does he go running, this lad? Uh, when there's a competition, it's coming into season now with the summer coming along. Yeah, yeah. Keith, we, we, I think I'd definitely be interested in... Um, uh, it was Harry, was it? Harry, yeah. I'd definitely be interested in um, in uh, supporting Harry and, and showing his movies. Gene, uh, Gene, whilst the wife's just said, Gene Hackman in Loose Cannons, where uh, Gene Hackman was searching for... The, a German officer was searching for people who knew who killed Hitler, and he was with Dan Aykroyd, who did all, like, goofy goofy characters. That was a terrible film. But Gene Ackman, I really like. Um, did you film... You, early, early 90s. Did you film that? No. I That's not a sports that. videos? No, it's Hollywood. I've heard of them. They've done some good ones, haven't they? Aye. Yeah. All the Batmans and that. So, anyway, yeah. Dan Aykroyd might be coming on this show soon. I'll ask him to do the voices. From Loose Cannon? Ah, oh, whatever. I'll bet he's got other voices. OK, Keith. Well, I've... I've um, you, you get those videos to me. Oh, yeah, I lost the last then, yeah. Not, not Loose Cannon, the Harry video. Aye, I will do. And, um, I, uh, yeah, we'll put that up on the, the rabbit hole. That's brilliant. Thanks so much. That's that's thank you. You're, you're, you and your family are a real inspiration. Oh, cheers, uh, Ian. That's nice. Here we go. Oh three four 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 nine nine one thousand is the telephone number. <laughs> Late night on talk We have ways of making you talk. Good evening, Keith. Hello, is that Ian, not the other fella? This is the uh, this is Ian Keith. Uh, hi again, Ian. I don't know if you, I phoned the other night about uh, my boy and his running. Remind me, Keith. I get a lot of calls. I don't remember them all. Um, I've got a uh, it's my nephew uh, called Harry. And I phoned up wondering if you would like a video of his fast running for um, for your rabbit hole. You said you might be interested, like. Oh yes, yes, yes. Have you have you sent the video to me yet? No, but that's why I, I wouldn't have, uh, wouldn't have bothered you really, like. But he got a letter from his school today, right? Yes. And um, it says that he he's not been selected to do athletics for the next term. Why is that? Um, it's just. I've, well, I've subsequently uh, phoned up Ian to ask about why, because he loves his athletics so much. He's got the proper vest and that, and uh, he's adapted his training shoes so they look more like uh, more like fast shoes. You what know? is it? What is he? Is he um, drawn like a, a Nike tick on there, or is he drawn like a sort of? How was he done? Stuck little bits of smoke out the back, cut out of paper. No, that would be a good one like that, but uh, it, yeah. like Roadrunner. Like you have to keep them aerodynamic, like so. It's just stickers and uh, stuff that he's got off the cartoon magazines, you know. Um, of like fast characters who are fast runners themselves. I don't know if you remember Road Runner. Road Runner, Billy Wiz. Billy Wiz, I oh, was one of the fastest. Yeah. Um, I've never been. Go on. You're gonna, you're gonna reminisce about Billy Wiz. I'm keen to share your mem. I want to step into your memories. No, I was just thinking because. When they drew Billy Wiz, like, they would, like, draw so you couldn't see Billy Wiz, you know, 
Sometimes it, you were looking at the square you thought he was in, but he was already at the end of the cartoon. That's how fast he was. I uh, oh, he's right fast and and like, so I doubt I'll be able to video him. I mean, my boy's not that. No, he was not that fast. Like no, um, <laughs> but he would decorate his trainers with these oh, characters. With fast characters, yeah, fast characters. But so. Um, it was just done alphabetically, which just doesn't seem fair, because there's probably a lad who really wants to play a cricket. Yeah. And he's not going to be able to play it. So I phoned up the fella, he's head of sport. Um, I don't suppose I should say his name, I'll just say he's called Mr C, yeah? And uh, he looks like Martin Freeman. You know Martin Freeman, the Hobbit? Mark? Hello, Ian. Yeah, yes, I do know Martin Freeman. Yeah, the, the yeah, the, the he's he's like every man, isn't he? Yeah, well, that's Mister. Don't Mr. say C, but no. No, is Mister C his actual name? No, like um, like you mean like Johnny Be Good or Arthur C. Clarke, something like that. <laughs> <laughs> Arthur C. Clarke, yes, like like Johnny Be Good or Arthur C. Clarke, yes. Or um, uh, William H. Brambles? No. Mercy. All I, all I wanted to say was, like, if, if you were relying on the past videos, yes. you know, if he, yes, because it's done I'm relying on you. And um, don't let me yeah, down, don't Keith. Think, don't let well, me down, I, Keith. You promised. Well, no. I will, if he ends up playing cricket, I can do sports video, bat and ball. Um, edition or something like that. Or oh, is the word cricket copyrighted? Cricket? He, he's, not, he's not called Mr. Cricket, is that what you're saying? No, I'm saying you're saying you're going to call the video bat and ball, but if the game he's playing is cricket, then why don't we just call it cricket? Or is cricket like hacky sack and it's copyrighted? I suppose I could call it sports, sports video cricket match. That's not bad. Yeah. And... and uh, would, uh, could you... Would, no, would he would he be running in that video? If it was cricket, no, I imagine he'd be pretty static, really, unless he gets the ball. But he's not uh, not really that sporty, you know. But could you not send me some of his old videos of him running, Keith? I've only got the one, but I did his portrait. I don't know if you remember. Oh yeah, it. no, I don't want. I don't want to see it portrait. I don't. I don't want to see I don't want to not portrait Catherine. You don't, it's not worth it. It's not worth it. No, it's not worth it. Um, well, is the lad? Is he disappointed, the lad? Oh, he's devastated. Oh. I'm not. I'm not this local parentis. Do you know what I mean? So sorry. I'm not this local parentis. What Latin, so, Latin teacher? No, it means that I'm not the person who's responsible for like disciplining him or this care. Are you not his dad? No, he's my nephew. Oh, sorry, I'm, I'm misunderstood. Okay, you can still discipline. Oh. A, you can still discipline a nephew. Oh, I can't step on. Uh, I can't step on his dad's toes. His, uh, his, well, if he knew his dad, man, he's not long out the neck, you know. Just leave that one there. Anyway, I'm off work at the moment, you know. Uh, so I've got a bad arm as well. So I was thinking about you with the injections. <laughs> So I'd I'd raise my um, arm in a in a fist, but I can't. Oh, because you're frustrated. No, like um, uh, like the black men at the Olympics, solidarity. Oh, it, I mean, like a campaign to get him to back into the athletics. Um, no, no, terrible. no, to show solidarity with you because your arm, you've hurt your arm. I was, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I was just thinking out loud, Keith. Yeah, I've had um, proper operation, you know, with the keyhole, keyhole camera surgery. What was wrong? Um, cuff rotator had, had torn. So I said, to, I said to the wife, I said, that doesn't sound very helpful. No. And so I've had the operation, I'll be honest with you, it's worse. Well, it, but it will improve, though, I mean, it's often worse after the operation, and then it will Im Im improve as, as things go, won't it? I hope so. I know yours does as well. Well, thank you very much indeed, Keith. I I, I appreciate that, and um, I, I, best of luck to the young lad. And uh, I hope he um, I hope he finds success playing. What game was it again? Bat and ball. 
it's, it's good enough to do have a cricket match or bat and ball. Yeah. Well. I'll tell him, tell him what you said anyway, you know. Okay, well, thank you, Keith. He's you, 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 very lucky to have um, uh, an uncle like you, even if you are disabled. Yeah, for, uh, yeah. No, he is lucky, and uh, I, I have to remind him of that often. Good night, Keith. Good night, night. Um, oh three four 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 nine nine one thousand eight nine three. Late night, Ian Lee on Talk Radio. We have ways of making you talk. Evening, Keith. Hello, Ian. Hello, Keith. Hi, Ian. I was. I don't know if you remember. I'm trying to. I wanted to update you about the sports video about fast running. I was going to do to help you with your a rabbit hole. Now, just re- re- Keith, I've been off um, with tonsillitis recently. Yeah, I know. So I've been a little. I've been a little bit ill, and I've, I've, if I'm completely honest, I've, I've, bits of my memory have been erased. Um, so you've we've, you've called before, have you? I. It's like I, w- I had first heard about Rabbit Hole through the Ian Lee show, and I thought I might be able to help to launch it because oh, I okay. do sports videos. This, do you got, remember? I've got you now. You right? Okay. So the Rabbit Hole is the the, the, the TV channel I'm, I'm doing on YouTube. Um, and if I remember correctly, you've got a, a young niece who is a fast no, cyclist. It's my nephew, nephew Harry. It's Harry, and he's he's into his um, he's into his running. He's a fast runner. Yes, and I uh, and I do a sports video. Yes, so I wanted to send you one sports video, fast running, featuring Harry. Like yes, well, but... I still haven't received that. No, you haven't, and that's, I feel quite apologetic about it, but that's what I'm here to update you, you see. OK. Because, yeah, because we just live... There's a playing field right next to us here, right? Yep. And they've marked it out for athletics over the bank holiday. Yes. Yeah, and I thought, oh, well, that's a brilliant chance to get Harry down and do the, the video for Ian, like. Yeah. And But I don't normally let him on this field because the headmaster's got a couple of Doberman, you know, Yes. Um, well, I mean, one of them might be a lass, I'm not sure, but a couple of Dobermen anyway. And you have to do a lot of dirt, so I don't really like him playing on there. So I went. The, head ma- the headmaster? Ah, he's got two Dobermen. And he doesn't clean up their dirt? No, we watch him from the top, I tell you. That I'm, is I'm outrageous. I, I know, because they're big dogs, so they do big drops, you know what I mean? Well, they're the size of human drops sometimes. Uh, I tell you what, some of them, I go and clear them up with a tennis racket, you know, I, I leave it under and I shot them out, out of the way of where the kids are going to be. But I tell you, some of them are the length of the racket handle. Blimey. You've got to be yeah, careful with that, I, Keith, because you can get, um, go blind with all that. I will listen up to my story because it gets worse oh, to God. do with the... You see, so I got Harry out there, right? And... Um, I got. I had a. Vi- I have a video recorder, uh, or old fashioned one, but it's better quality than a phone. Right. Okay. So right. like VHS. Oh, I, I, I wouldn't know. You know. I'm sorry. It's okay. It's, it's got play, record, it's pause, that sort of Fast thing. Fast forward and rewind. Yeah. You take a little card out. Oh. oh okay. It's it. digital. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, um, I I stand at one end and he runs towards me, right? Yes. And I've put up. Do you know those little um, the sort of posts they used to to um, mark off the cricket green. It's like a metal spikes. Um, Are you with me there? Are yeah, you? I think so. I think so. I'm not a big fan of cricket, but I think I've got it. Yeah. All uh, right. Well, I've got a load of tape from Juno you know Thornton's and Hotel Chocolate, the the retail outlets for fancy chocolate, and they do the ribbons and that. Well, I've collected the ribbons and I made like a finishing line for him. Do you know what I mean? Out of um, Hotel Chocolate ribbons. And thought, and I've combined the two, like, um, you know, it, it's a little bit striking because of the different colours, but... Uh, it's a lot of chocolate. I, oh, it's not my chocolate. I'm allergic to it. It brings me out in humps. So, um, of course, he runs towards it, and I've got some beautiful shots of him, but as he came through the tape, it's tough stuff, that hotel chocolate stuff. So it pulled up the... Um, it didn't break, is what I'm trying to say. It yeah. pulled up the the, the posts. Oh, he fell on his face, and the terrible thing is, is just it almost touching his lip. He fell into the uh, the dog the dog dirt. So that's pretty bad, that, isn't it? 
That is dis- and, that is disgusting. And another thing I just so wanted to sad. say yeah. is that I've got worried because we put the video up and you can see um, Ari's face, right? And a couple of years back, I took some pictures of his 14th birthday party, right? And and a mate then a couple of days later got in touch with me because I'd put him on Facebook, what you were talking about, like. Yeah. And he sent me this photo and it was from one of them, like, bestiality sites, you know? And someone had cut out Harry's head and put it on top of a monkey. And, I mean, that's awful for the kid, isn't it? That's what will happen these days. So I don't want to send you it. I want to pixelate it. Ian. <laughs> yes, that is, that is awful. Poor lad. What was the monkey doing? Or is it best I, not to say? Well... You know, the monk, in the monkey's hand, they'd put on, like, a tuba loop. A tuba loop? So it, aye, like loop, you know, so it was pretty obvious what was going on. Yeah. So... That's horrible. I've got kids. That's horrible. You don't want people doing that. Some sick no, you've got to be there. so careful. I need to learn about pixelation. Then it's it's all go, fast, vid, fast running. But I don't, I don't want to put a video up of him falling um, into some dog dirt, even if it is pixelated. No, I'm going to destroy that one, Ian. I'm going to get him out again at the weekend. Yeah. Or there's a bank holiday coming up towards the end of the month. There is, yeah. Yeah, and I'm either going to... If I haven't learned how to pixelate, I'll put a mask on him. I mean, I know that sounds stupid, but I don't want it... You know, it's it's, it's his privacy, isn't it, really? It is a, we could do this as a phone in, Keith, actually. 0344 499 1000. Whose face would you like to see on Keith's nephew Harry in his running video? Ah, oh, that's kind, like that's nice. No monkeys. We don't want to. We don't want to relive no, that. Monkeys is a sore subject. We don't want to relive that. But maybe. Right. Um, no thanks. Maybe um, a sports Paula Paula Radcliffe. Aye, that'd be nice. That'd be canny if you could get her permission. Like, I don't think you'd need her permission to do it. Aye. Well, he's pretty damn fast anyway. You only get little glimpses of it, you know. Well, Keith, listen, I'm, I'm, I hope everything's all right. I hope you... you, you uh, how did you clean the dog dirt off? Uh, well, we took him to the hospital, but uh, the told us... Um, I thought he might need a tet- um, tet- tetanus. Yeah. But he didn't need a tetanus. They just said use a wet wipe or a cloth or something like that. Um, I have some hand wash that's got, that describes itself as for sanitising, so... We put a bit of that on and out. He's absolutely fine, really? honestly. He's as fast as he as I've seen him. Uh, it's uh, it's Keith. It's an important uh, issue you, with loads of important issues, and, uh, and shame on that headmaster for not cleaning that dog dirt up. That really quite, is disgusting. Shame on him. Quite right. I'll get it to you as soon as I can, Ian. Thank you, mate. Take care, Keith. Bye-bye. Bye bye. Bye. Cheers, fella. Oh three four 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 nine nine one thousand. Whose face would you like to see on um, Keith's? That's terrible. About Lionel that. Richie. That's terrible about that bestiality side. Yeah, I mean, that where is... to begin? The Doberman or, or women? Uh, the Jubaloob. Ah, oh, flipping heck. Some people, eh? Um... OK. 03444991000 is the um, telephone number if you want to give us a call. Unmissable late night radio with the original king of unconventional conversation. Make contact with Ian Lee. Late night Ian Lee on Talk Radio. We'll get you talking. Alton, let's go to line 13. Good evening, line 13. Hello? Hello, Lee. Yes, you're on the radio. Oh, hello, Ian. It's Keith. I was just phoning because I'm so chuffed about my video of me fast. Fast running sports. Oh, you know? Keith, you sent that video through this morning to me. It was fantastic. Oh, thanks. I was pretty pleased with it. Um, I got the music wrong a bit, but uh, yeah, I was pretty pleased. And it's video of the week. It, it's movie of the week on on Rabbit. Oh, shall I? Uh, shall I play the video on the radio now? Do you think that would work? Oh well, I'll be honest with you. I'm, I've had the lad Harry round tonight because I have him on Friday nights. You know. Yeah. And we've probably listened to it 30 times. You've made them so happy, like, oh, for that. It's an incredible... Shall I play the video so the people can listen to it? Well, I, I don't know. It was, it, I don't know. It might be a bit boring, because I've made it super visual, you know? It, it, you have made it very, very visual. You've, just, you've done a lot of fancy editing on that, haven't you? 
Oh yeah, it took us. I think it was three, three and a half hours. It took us. Um, I take two boiled eggs to, to the what? library, and usually I'll only get through one of them, and I'll just chuck the other one away. I'll chuck it at the town hall. But um, I had both of them, so I have two eggs. I knew that I'd put quite a shift in, you know. But anyway, it was worth it. Did you see the starburst effect? I did see the starburst. I tell you what I found interesting because there's a bit where you had a countdown: three, two, one. Aye. And the three and the two were the same font. Aye. But the one was. I know what you're going to say. The one was a different. It was like from some. You'd sourced it from somewhere different, and I thought that was unusual. No, actually, originally it was three, two, one in the same um, format. But I just wanted that moment to really kick in, so I made it hashtag one. I, did you see the hashtag? It looks like a moat or something, like a, a Paul Cullis. I did see the hashtag. I'm watching the video now. It's, it's absolutely... I'll retweet it again. It's had 795 views. Um, oh, that's something, isn't it? It's got pictures of Usain Bolt, um, a leopard. There's the number three. Then it goes to two. And then you're right, it's hashtag one. Can, can I be critical? I expect you're not going to be happy about it being portrait. I'm like not that. happy about it being portrait. What were you thinking, man? Well, I, will, I don't know if, if you look at the video really closely, like, there was a certain amount of um, pressure I was under because it's on the school field, right? And there was uh, a policeman were there. There were a lot you know? of policemen there. Yeah, I know because as far as, well, I don't want to, I want to have a boy in everyone, but there was a lot of police there because apparently a big dog had, had attacked a little dog. What? And mm. there were, you know, you, they're not very approachable, the police and that. And they no. That. Happy because my Harry had to wear a balaclava and they it wanted does, to know what, what does it say? From. What does it say on his balaclava? Does it say fairies? Not canaries, he's not a city fan, and that's okay. their nickname. Okay, see. okay. Um, and he didn't, he, he doesn't look like you can see where he's going. He didn't tread on any dog mess or anything, did he? No, I mean, I don't know if people are going to spot it, but the, the racetrack he's on is actually it's a primary school, like, and that's only that's probably for the egg and spoon race or for the sack race. Right, but I put him on the big track, the big lad's track, with the bobble at over his face. And he started veering off, you know, towards the cricket pitch. Um, and you're not allowed on the cricket pitch, and with coppers there anyway, that's, may, I thought we'd better just go on the nippers yeah. track. For, but oh, I just wanted to say thank you. And, like, he, I had him tonight because his mum and dad... He's, uh, he's bloody fast, Keith. He is bloody right. fast. He's not the fastest in his year. There's... What's in his class? Twenty-seven, and he, I think he's, he'll fluctuate between like seventeen and nineteen. But it's a pretty swift lad. So I had him tonight, and a smile on his face, watching it together. His parents are at the country in Western night. They're in a, a duo called um, Meadow Horse. It's just do Dolly Parton and Doctor Hook and that. And then his his mum comes and picks him up at ten uh, ten o'clock, like because his dad is in um, Wigwam and Co, which does most like blue country stuff, you know, like about hot dogs and sausages. You know what I mean. Something for the dads, a bit of adult fun. Aye, aye, for the dads and the, the lit team. Yeah. Um, you spelt your name wrong at the end, but that's that's fine. These things happen. No, I know. It's, have you ever it, edit tools, man? I, I, it's a different language to me. I, you know, I did my best. What was the, What's the duo called that his mum and dad are in? No, it's the, the, the mum and dad together, yeah. it's more country ballads, and they're called Meadow Horse. It's lovely. To, it's a lovely image, isn't it, the horse in the meadow? Yeah. And and then when they're finished... He does wigwam. He does wag, wigwam and co. He'd, he'd kick me head in if I got that wrong. Wigwam and co. OK. Well, listen, the video is brilliant. Some of the comments... Let me read some of the comments that are underneath it. Um, uh, isn't it hot running with a coat on? Um, all I saw, saw was a fuzzy blur, too much speed. Um, astonishing. My goodness, that's fast running. Um, oh, that's not bad, is it? It's in portrait. I only want to see videos in landscape. Oh, shit. I... <laughs> Dear. Um, well, Keith. Anyway, so... Thanks again and that. Um, Thank I, you. I'm going to do another one, you know. Oh, God.
That I look forward to that. What's it going to be? Is it bat and ball? No, it's not. Um, he's going to do uh, fast eating. Um, he's go- he, d- he had th- three hot dogs tonight at uh, three minutes. That's just the sausage, not the bun and all. That'd be daft, wouldn't it? Um, and I'm going to check up, but I think that's pretty fast. I know that you've had trouble before with his image being used on a, um, uh, a bestiality site. Aye. He's put his head on a monkey, can you? And he'll never live that down. Um, with the tuba lube, wasn't it? Um, Aye. And I just wa- wa- worry, if you film him eating hot dogs... Is, oh, God, is, I'm with you, yeah. Is, th- is there a chance that someone could put that on a... On a... I know what you don't even have to say. It. I know what you mean. I don't, and I don't, I don't want him to have, you know, I don't want him to be involved in anything blue. Well, I, I, I mean, he'd, he'd never get them through his bobble hat. But you, I tell you what, you let me worry about that. All right, Keith, nice one. Because it'll be fast. Mate. That's all I promise. Thank you so much, Keith. Thanks, Ian. Thanks again. Have a great weekend, mate. Take care. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <coughs> um, I think we should probably have a break. Across the UK, online and on DAB. Get an earful of unusual nocturnal emissions with radio's Lord of Misrule, Ian Lee. No relation, thank God. Unfiltered Night Talk with the original king of unconventional conversation. Late Night, Ian Lee on Talk Radio. We have ways of making you talk. Across the UK, online and on DAV. Take a far out trip into the twilight zone of late night radio with Ian Unmissable late night radio with the original king of unconventional conversation. Make contact with Ian Lee. Late night Ian Lee on Talk Radio. We have ways of making you talk. Oh three four 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 nine nine one thousand is the telephone number. Mr. Pete Heat has gone, dear listener. He has gone. What a absolutely incredible. Love it. Oh three four 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 nine nine one thousand is the telephone number. If you want to give us a call, Keith's on the line. Good evening, Keith. Hi, Ian. You all right? I'm all right, thank you. Did you uh, did you listen to Pete, the magician? Uh, well, I've got to be honest with you. Um, I, I thought he four tricks in an hour. I thought it was a bit slow, Ian, to be honest. Um, you know, slow magic I, made me instantly think. You'll see what I'm thinking. Okay. Made me instantly think I could get my Harry to do fast magic. Well, can, blow him out the water, you know what well, I mean? Well, can Harry actually do magic? No, but I imagine you can teach it from the internet. You know what I mean? I, I'm not saying that Pete, Pete Feet isn't good. Like, I'm Pete, just saying... Pete. Pete, Pete Heat isn't good. I'm just saying that... Slow. He was um, slow. It was, a bit, it was four tricks in an hour, but I counted. It's okay. So, but, so, uh, okay. So you would have preferred... How many tricks would you have liked to have heard? I'd have liked quick fire, like ram, bam, bam, you know, like trick, trick, trick. Can... So, trick, trick, trick. Can I... Uh, before we go any further, can I... I've got... Choose discomfort over resentment. Can I, can I bring up something, Keith, that, that has been worrying me all day? Is it because of me text text last night? Yeah, swearing you, night, you yeah, you sent me a very foul mouthed um, text last night, um, and it says, and I'm I'm going to censor it, 
Oh, don't, man. I mean, don't read it out, Ian. What a effing lying bee. You sent that in yeah. yesterday. I just wondered what that... I just wondered what the, the rationale was behind it. Well, of course, I wasn't referring to you, Ian. No. It was that fellow was on Clive. Yes. And I was absolutely livid. I mean, he was talking about my nephew, you know, saying he wasn't, wasn't fast. And that you know as well as me, the truth of it is... I've seen the video, yeah. Yeah, well, he's fast, like, and, and that's not can't can't be disputed. What well, the thing is is he he, he claimed the video movie of the week. He claimed the video was fake, and, and he, he was re re referencing the coppers' helmets wobbling. Oh yeah, he thought that was funny saying coppers. You could put that vid video in. I promise you could give it to the people who make the Batman's. You know the movies and that. The recent ones and or the ones with Val Kilmer. I I don't I don't know who's in them. I'm so sorry. I hear about that. I don't know the stars. I just because I like to think of it as, as really as Batman. You know, but I was all, all I was phoning to say, yep. Ian, was like mm. it, the truth of it is. I know this bloke, Clive. He's, he's at, at me nephew's, uh, and the truth is, yeah. he's calling his son faster than my son, he and that he wanted, wanted the truth to come out. Yes. Well, the truth is, his son isn't actually as fat as Clive says. One, and two, it's Clive who's the fat lad. We call him um, where we are in the estate. We call him Buttery Buttery Clive, and that's, buttery that's one. Buttery Clive. Why is that? Buttery. Well, one because he's fat, like the butter's made of fat, you know. Th these days. Why and not call second, him Lard? But well, it's just it's but, Buttery Clive is what he's always been called. That he's, he's from a notorious family of butterers, you know, because the it's the word like for because they spread rumours all the time. Like the rumour he spread last night that that video is not actually real. Okay, well, listen, but, I want listen. Let I don't you 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 and Clive need to get together and have a chat and sort this out. Okay, I, this I don't want my show turning into Jeremy Kyle. Um, you you mentioned um that there might be another video of Harry eating um was it jacket potatoes? <laughs> no, it was um hot dogs, but just the hot dog sausages, not the bun. But, not the bun, no. So, but they it, on the tin it says hot dog sausages. So it's just the hot dog sausages. But what I'm actually going to do, and I was I wouldn't have phoned if it wasn't for this Clive fella. Yeah. Because I was going to surprise you because he's going to do, um, um, and I'm going to do it uh, next Monday with him. He's going to do fast cycling, you know, on the bike on his bike. Oh yeah. And, and and you haven't reacted that favourably to it, but I'll I'll send it in. And well, it I mean, might, his might bikes get in the rabbit hole. Well, I don't know if it might not. Bikes, it's easy to be fast on a bike, isn't it? Ah, oh, you don't see. There's ways of being fast, though, isn't there? Well, if you think of it more stunt work. Well, if you because the way to get fast on a bike is there's several ways. One is to go downhill. One yeah. is to kind of lean over, so you're like hunched over, so it, you're more aerodynamic. Aye. Um, and um, the other is to um, have uh, be towed by a car. I'm not towing him on a car, Ian. I don't want to do that. Okay, just saying. Um, what? Imagine this. Say, for example, yes. you live in a world where the bike would take off from the ground surface. Yes. And the speed occurred once it had left the surface of. Um, you know what I mean? It had left the ground. Like a rocket bike. Well, well, mate, I didn't say that, Ian. No, I'm ask, I'm asking you. <laughs> are, you are you saying Harry's got a rocket bike? Like Evil Knievel or Eddie Kid? Is that what no. you're saying? No, what I'm saying, Ian, is that if you can imagine that, yes. what a rocket bike would be like. Yes. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry to laugh. I'm sorry to laugh, Keith, because I know you take these things very seriously. But it does feel like you've 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 um you, you've entered the world of fantasy. You're going to put uh, your young nephew on a rocket bike to prove <laughs> buttery Clive wrong. That's what you're going to do. That's insane, man. Well. Sounds to me like you're interested, though. I'm very interested. I smell a story, and it sounds good. It smells good. I'm going to call it Sports Video Rocket Bike. That's an excellent I'm, I'm, title for it. Well, so I just wanted to 
put you in the picture with that Clive fella if he rings up. Like he's an effing um, lying bee. Well, I'm sorry. That's how I feel about it. Okay. Um, okay. Ian, and that you know, trust me. Next Monday, Tuesday. Yep. Sports video. Uh, Rocket bike. I look forward to it. Way. All right, Keith. Way, rabbit hole. Keith, thank you so much. I really appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you, Wade. <laughs> Unmissable late night radio He's with the original king of unconventional <laughs> conversation. <laughs> Nick right. with Ian Lee. That's insane. Late night, Ian Lee on Talk Radio. Oh man, I'm talking. What?